Hey guys, if you want to see the full video and more clips and behind the scenes footage, make sure you check out youtube.com slash brilliant idiots pod. That's youtube.com slash brilliant idiots pod. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace. It's so stupid, it's positively brilliant. So, Charlotte, the question is, uh, how much longer do you think will be able to eat meat? My, my buddy, Mark, has a theory that they will make it illegal to consume meat at some point once we have a reasonable replacement like that uh, Beyond Burger Not type America, thing. Because of that whole freedom thing. Like, now you fuck. getting it, right? Yeah, hey, they're not, they not going to have a, a banned meat. But, but Chris has a feeling that it will just be more efficient. Well, what is the idea? All right, so, you know, I, I uh, wrote a book about veganism with Russell Simmons. I spent a lot of time okay. studying it. Uh, I don't believe that veganism is the ultimate answer. I don't believe that eating a lot of soy is necessarily that much processed soy, specifically. Yeah, it's, it's not good, it's not good either. Having strokes, they say you, vegans, are, vegans are, are to have a higher risk of strokes than vegans. Right. It's, it's all a myth, this whole vegan so thing. So I'm saying that just to preface what I'm about yeah. to say. But having done a ton of research, hours and hours of research, I do not think the amount of meat that humans beings consume is at all sustainable. We can't keep this up so the that, way we, that's the we're argument. doing it. If we can't keep doing it, right. and we can't create a substitute, at what point... If the substitute is more sustainable and equally as delicious and probably cheaper because, listen, to keep a cow alive takes a lot of fucking water. Right. You got to like have this pasture nice, all this land. Sure. To keep a fake patty alive is nothing. So if it becomes cheaper, just as good, and they can get the health components equal. Never happen. You you say it will never happen. The health component will never happen. Because ah, it's because some it's not natural. Bullshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, it has to be like, natural. That, that shit they got at KFC. Think about how stupid this sound. Plant based chicken. Yeah. <laughs> like, what's wrong with us as a people? Like, yeah, that, why yeah. does that make sense to anybody? Oh, plant based chicken. How? Yeah, Chickens yeah. are not made out of grass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so it's impossible. So that's some GMO bullshit. So either right. way, it's GMO. Beyond Burgers, Impossible Burgers, it's all GMO bullshit. Right. You know how much shit they got to put in there for that shit to taste like meat? You know how much shit they got to put in there for that shit to taste like chicken? Yeah. So you better off just eating the regular shit. Right. But what if they're, what if we get to a point where, the population density is so much that we can't supply it with chicken and meat and maybe chicken and meat and these types of things are reserved for like the super really, really rich. That's where it's headed. It is kind of where it's headed, right? Meat should be extremely expensive. Right. And you should eat it on rare occasions. Cows should be extremely expensive. What's not chickens, because chickens ain't going nowhere. They're not going nowhere. <laughs> Literally, no they way. can't fly. Right. And, um, they are built to be eaten. And, they, and really, everybody should be eating more fish anyway. Like right. If your body is made of three fourths of water, and we know that the earth is made of three fourths of water, but there are not very much fish in the sea, and the factory Stop farming it. fish. Blame that on the Japanese. That's not true. Well, yeah, the Japanese are the worst. No, there's maybe fucking the, the, the fish. Them fishes, bro. Have, the oceans fish. have been wildly depopulated of fish, and the factory farming, which is all these salmon in these facilities, GMO. That stuff is not good for you either. Tilapia, tilapia is not even a real fish. So right. I, that broke my heart. <laughs> that broke my heart. <laughs> the they not charge like that's not fish even a real fish. Even a Isn't real that fish. crazy? Can Broccoli's you break not this a real down? Vegetable. Can you break down the tilapia thing? What tilapia is a is a what they made tilapia. It's like a, a hybrid between. Yeah, I forgot. Actually, I want to say a salmon week. and a. But whiting? does it swim? Yeah, it's a fish. Oh God, I thought it's that they fish. were just like. But it's a it's hybrid not an insect. I mean, it's a fish. No, not an answer. I thought that they were just like making the patty, and there was no head, no tail. Nah, no, you're no, not no. gonna go to you're not gonna go to the Caribbean and somebody pull a tilapia out those. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They'll pull out some mai mai. There's some grouper. They'll pull out some tuna, some grouper. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's a ain't, ain't no, ain't no. Uh, uh, it's not a tilapia. pure breed. It's not a pure nah, breed. It's, it's not, not a pure breed. It's not a blue nose. By the way, this is why I love going to the islands. When you go to the islands, if they don't have it, they don't have it. They will right. tell you things aren't in season. Right. Yes. Season is the key. We got to start eating by season. That's again. it. Yeah, but motherfuckers want avocados in yeah, December. Yeah, be able to walk into a, a, a supermarket and just no. be like, I Yo, want strawberries. It's how not strawberry season. How crazy seasoning. is this? Like, what kind of work, like, how fucking fortunate are we that any time of year, if you want guacamole, you get guacamole. Right. Like, any time of year, yeah. you want uh, lettuce, you get lettuce. This was seasonal 
for the vast majority yes. of human existence. And it should go you back to that. You didn't get blueberries until fucking October, buddy. If we do that, obesity rates will go down. Absolutely. America will start appreciating these yes. things more. Yes. You know what I'm saying? These things will be luxuries. They'll yes. be treats. Like, yes. oh, strawberries and whatever time of year. I've been looking forward to getting mangoes in Taiwan all year. All year I've been looking forward when I went on my last trip. When I got there, it wasn't well, mango season. season. Amen. Oh well. Amen. Oh well. Hey, I'll try to find next you year. a Mexican on the street. Hey. Right. <laughs> then it's not the same. Not you the said same. I, I think I don't think that the oceans. I mean, it's all the ocean. But when you go to those islands, they treat their oceans a little bit different. I don't see them running out of lobster, bro. I don't see them running out of crayfish because they eat them during season. Like when I was in Turks and Caicos last weekend, it was lobster season everywhere. You, I mean, you jump in a regular car. Hey, you know it's lobster season. Right. You're at the hotel. Hey, yeah, it's yeah. lobster season. Everything had lobster stuff on the menu. Lobster yeah. rolls, lobster uh, risotto, everything. Why? Because it was in season. Yeah. And it was like, get it while you can. It's in season. The biggest illusion when it comes to, uh, you know, like luxury food is that lobster is expensive. The lobsters are cockroaches of the sea. Right. They yeah, they yeah, yeah, they yeah. produce they reproduce like, like crazy. Yeah. They actually should have no real value, but since we look at them as really expensive, they've been able to like maintain that shit. Because of red lobster. Because growing up, at least for me, <laughs> growing up in the country, red lobster was five star dining. That was right. fine cuisine. Right, right, you take right, a girl right. to red lobster, it's on and popping, yo. That's what drug dealers did. Yeah, I'm pulling up the red lobster. I didn't know no better. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, Cheddar yeah. cheese biscuits. Delicacy, Got him. delicacy to me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So red lobster just made it like some fancy. Like, this shit fancy. Yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pick your lobster out that tank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whatever lobster you want. I thought they just brought them from the back. Oh, nah, they be in the tank. I mean, okay. I don't know. I've never eaten one out the tank. I always say it, but yeah, I don't know if they actually yeah, yeah. bring me the one out the tank. Them shit just be in bondage. Them right. shit just be like, <laughs> it's S and M. Yeah, they just be tied up in the tank. I'm like, why do you got them tied up in the tank? We went to the uh, Taipei fish market when we were over there. Wild, wild. On your recommendation to get sushi, incredible or no? Incredible, but uh, you know, t tanks bigger than this room filled with crabs. Tw my daughter's a vegetarian now. She started crying in the middle. Of the she place. couldn't. She couldn't handle it. It was insane. Well, don't take her to the zoo. Shit. <laughs> but they're not, eating, they're not eating the lion. I the mean, zoo is just, the zoo is worse. Uh, the zoo is sad. Yes, it is, man. To me, the, the zoo, zoo is, is depressing. Yes, the zoo is depressing, depressing as fuck. Yeah, the zoo is. is animal slavery. Yeah. If, right. I, was, if I gave a fuck, yeah. I'd be protesting but that the, shit. The, the fish yeah. market is genocide. <laughs> yeah. The fish market is straight up genocide. Yeah. It's the slavery versus genocide. I don't know which is worse. Why? Because you're eating them? Cause they, you pluck the crab right out of the tank, and, and then just you get the sushi, shit. and it's fucking delicious. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Really? The Unreal. tuna noticeable difference with the tuna or what? I stuck with. Uh, I called somebody, and they were like, "Stick with the eel and the crab." That's 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 the their thing. That's their thing. That's okay. the absolute freshest out here. Unbelievable. Unreal. The food couldn't have been that good if your daughter went vegan. She didn't even have it. Wow. She, she was to just eat. too triggered by that. Yeah, shit. she couldn't handle it. So how'd you eat? What'd you do? Rice, rice and yeah. vegetables the rest of the trip. Okay. And That's one thing Asians do better than most people. What, eat rice? Not give a fuck about animals. Yes. What do you like, mean? They but, cannot give a fuck about oh, animals. Oh, you ain't never been to the country, huh? <laughs> Let me tell you, you something. You ain't never been to South Carolina, Virginia, Alabama, Georgia. Y'all ain't eating jellyfish out there. Shit, because we eating possums. And raccoons. But that's easy. That's like well, that's that's a tasty delicacy. That's bear nothing. shoulder. That bear shoulder is nothing. Jellyfish, lizard. There's nothing that Chinese people won't eat. Nothing. They're nothing. That's why they'll beat us all. That's why they'll outlive us all. There's nothing they won't eat. What's the life expectancy of a Chinese person? Thousand, thousand years. Thousand, two thousand, two thousand years. years. Yeah. Yeah. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Son, there's nothing they won't eat. They, yeah. they will eat anything. You know how we have like picky eaters? That doesn't yeah. exist in China. Yeah, 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 I had chicken's yeah. feet on this last trip. Please, been doing that since a kid, man. Chicken Great. Feet. Chicken feet? Yes! I'm from South Carolina. Chicken feet. Chicken was feet. Delicious. What are you talking about? Delicious. Maybe eating chicken feet, man. But jellyfish, you're not eating. Nah, I never had no jellyfish. A, a lizard just spread like that, like on the cross. You never nah, had never that? Had no lizard. They nah. will eat that yeah, shit. Yeah, gator. Uh, gator might have been the closest thing I had to eat in the lizard. Dude. Like a uh, it, uh, dude, just just snake. Just, eat some snake. Yo, dude, snake. alligator, crocodile. Oh, gator's great. That's like chicken, right? No, it gator's literally good. Tastes no, gator's really chicken, good. Right? Yes, and alligator's good. Apparently, they breed like crazy because they're lizards, like those crocodile farms or whatever, like that. That um, that's what we should be eating. It's kind of rough with the gators, though, man. Why? Because they've been alive so long. So you just feel like a piece of shit eating <laughs> eating something that's been alive that long just because you're hungry. I don't know. This motherfucker done lived how many years? 600? I don't know. And you're going to just kill him? I don't like, feel bad man. at all. Animals, I don't have that thing with animals. I don't have that connection. 
Maybe some dogs. They're kind of cute and that kind of st- stuff. No, like- dogs are fucked up. I remember the time I seen one of my homeboys shoot a dog in the head because they used to fight pit bulls. Oh, boy. And this pit bull was like off. You know, he, he didn't couldn't win no more fights no more. Yeah. And so he just shot him in the head. And I remember no, my that's home- fucked up. I remember my homeboy saying, man, that boy, he going to have hard luck shooting that dog in the head like that. And yeah, he, he had did. A, he had a pretty. I, I rough don't like life. that fighting them. I don't like fighting a them. A pig that is kind of smarter stuff. than a dog, though. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, you, but you eat ribs every day. I you don't eat, eat pork. I don't eat pork. You don't eat pork anymore. Nah, I never oh, no, eat I, pork in I eat pig. Plus years. If you care about, if you care about dogs, you can't really eat pig because the, a pig is definitely smarter, more emotional, Yeah, but emotional, a pig isn't as, a, as attractive. Like a pig doesn't look cute. <laughs> nah, little baby pigs are really cute. No, By the way, I've never eaten dog. Disgusting. Yeah. On purpose. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I eat dog. If somebody gave it to you and you ate that shit, if somebody, if you ate that shit, like that shit, good as fuck. Dude, I've eaten horse. I've had horse. I've had horse. I've had horse. Easily. Yeah. I could eat any animal. I really could eat most animals as long as they were delicious. I'm just saying I don't have the same affinity for these fucking animals. I think it's a big crock of shit. We don't need all these animals. I yeah. think that you have you have cows, chickens, pig, well, some fish. The thing, and I'm not smart enough to speak to this, but yeah. most of these animals serve a bigger purpose in this ecosystem I don't buy other that than at us all. eating them. Don't believe it. No, nah, that's the truth. I don't believe it. Because don't have cows fart. It... Uh, Oh, uh, closes the ozone layer. Yeah, no, no, it order. opens it. It's bad for the it's ozone bad. layer. Kill all the cows. Oh, we don't want them doing that. Kill all the cows. There were cow farts cause more erosion the earth of the ozone layer than all the cars and shit combined. You know why y'all feel that way? This is why y'all feel that way about cows now. Cause motherfuckers is turning vegan, and because people are drinking almond milk because yeah. they know that cow milk is bad. So now y'all just you like, out of here, bro. Bye. That is See not you later. Right. We out of here. <laughs> Give them to India. They love them. <laughs> That's God. That's God to Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's going to get mighty fucking hot when that ozone layer gone. Mm. Talk to God about that. There's a hole in the ozone layer. The cows farted into it. Yeah. But no, remember, they they stopped talking about it. Chick fil A been trying to save us (laughs) from the jump. They really might be onto it. Maybe Chick fil A really does have this close connection to God because they got us eating the Popeye sandwich. They really got us in chicken. Eat more chicken. Burgers aren't slapping like they used to. Name nah, a burger that's bro, been popping. When you get some real beef, when mm-hmm. you get some real meat, like mm-hmm. out of the country somewhere, then burgers still be slapping. Yeah, bro. but it's not a national craze like you know, chicken is. Chicken is having a wave right now, bro. You know what I realized about burgers and chicken and all that shit? I don't like the fixings. Meaning like, I don't like sandwiches and shit. I don't like hamburger buns and all that. I want to get right to it. Like, I don't, I don't I like that. Sandwiches are on the way out. I don't like them shit. Oh, I don't, I don't eat bread. Yeah, see, everyone's going to be doing that. They should. Yeah, the bread yeah. is poison. I don't like the bun, none of that shit. You're eating cardboard. I haven't had a sandwich in 10 don't years. Don't eat the sandwich. Yeah. Don't eat none of that shit. You just eat the fucking meat and have some veggies. That's it. That's it. Now, that's that's how human bread, beings now, what, eat things. Now, what about when the bread is baked properly? It tastes good. That shit is but good. But it's got to be a delicacy. Most gotta, things that I, taste I, good are horrible for you. Right. Most things that taste good are horrible for you. Nah. Name one thing that tastes good that's not bad for you. Man, fish, steak. Chicken, you know what they gotta put bread, on the fish? Yams. You ever eat a fish with nothing on it? Yes. Yo, Actually, when you go I did to the that Caribbean, in Japan. It's yeah, listen, when you go to the Caribbean and they get that shit right out the ocean, they'll yeah. be like, yo, the water got salt in it. Throw a little butter on it if you want. Yeah. Some lemon juice. Then they fry that motherfucker up and eat, then it's good, but eat. they fry it. Nah, they boil it. And Angola, they, Angola, they just boil it after you eat that shit. That shit is amazing. Nah, dude, Fresh lobster by ocean. itself is regular, bro. That's rags, dude. Lobster by itself? I need some butter. Not in the Caribbean, bro. I just had it. I just had it. In the Caribbean, when that shit come right out, the, when they take it right out that trap, mm-hmm. ooh, shit is, 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 is just seasoned so well by that water, man. No, the water is not seasoning anything, dude. Salt, it's salt water. It? No, dude. You don't want fucking lobster to taste like the ocean. Yes. When was the last time you took a bite of ocean and enjoyed That's it? That's when it's the best. Oh, yeah? You ever drink salt water by the glass? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's, called, that's called drowning. Right. <laughs> 